Viewer discretion is advised. My name is Billy. B-I-L-L-Y. Growing up with Billy, well, he's a normal kid. His parents got divorced, he had a bit of complex with them. Um, I was always the bad kid, getting into a lot of trouble. Now Connor, Connor was a really good friend of mine. We've been friends for a long time. And I think I met him early on. I had, I had, I had my first threesome with Connor. It was a heavy chick. She kind of reminded me of my mom a little bit. It was, it was nice. Sometime shortly after the threesome with the, the heifer, Billy started acting a little weird because she kind of looked like his mom. I noticed he was sleeping until like four in the afternoon. A little weird. I think the first time I had a bacon and eggs experience, I was like six. And my mom turned me on to it. And I don't know, there was just something that came over me when the yolk busted in my mouth for the first time that made me feel so gay. But not in a homosexual, like, meat pole stuck up my ass way. But just gay. It felt really good. She tried to get me to read Green Eggs and Ham when I was like six, and I was like, fuck ham, you know? Ham tastes like you're eating a pig's ass. But bacon? Bacon is just, it's like nothing in a big chick's face. It's so freaking good. Can I say that on TV? At first it was no big deal. I mean, I was a huge egg and bacon fan. Trish really did it in for me. Anytime I was mad, sad, angry, depressed, whatever. She would cook me breakfast. Then he started going overboard. And it was eggs and bacon in the morning, and eggs and bacon for lunch. God damn it, Billy, you ate all the eggs again. I just Baby, I'm sorry, okay? I just, I needed just a few of them just to get me through the day. My mother is coming over for Sunday brunch, and we don't have any fucking eggs and bacon! Okay, God, we don't even have to do this right now. I don't feel good. Of course just... you don't fucking feel good. You ain't done me! You just kicked me. You know, you just kicked you me. Shut up! It's sensitive there. You know what? Oh, I don't even like your mom. She She's constantly nagging at me. Nag, 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 nag. What, what am I gonna cook French toast with? Fuck French toast. You know, shit. I got real problems in my life. I really don't know what to do anymore. Every time I see him, he needs money, or eggs, or, or bacon. I know Trader Joe's has really cheap eggs, so sometimes I just take him there to buy some, but sometimes I just I just give them the money. Now Albertsons right now, they got their sale going on. It's a buck 99 a pound, that's half off. That means I can get two pounds for under five bucks. And you know I'm good for it. I just, I just need something to take the edge off. I can't support your habit. Damn it, Charlotte, it's not supporting the habit, okay? It's, 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 it's bacon, I just need a tiny bit. Now we need to remind him how much that we love him. We're not here to battle. We're here to just tell them how much we care. Megan! Megan! We are talking a buck ninety-nine a pound, normally three ninety-nine a pound, able to get two pounds for the price of one. What's this? We're all gathered here today. We've been talking and there's things that everyone wants to share because they care about you like crazy. Can you please have a seat? Connor, why don't you start? Billy, when we were growing up, things were great. I still, res I still remember the smile you had the first time we shagged that big girl that looked a lot like your mom. It was such a turn on for me personally because I've always wanted to bang your mom, but... But I just, can I go to the bathroom first? No. Hey, no. Give me back my bed. No.
If he needs his bits, let him have his bits. We don't have to make a big deal about it. Whatever we need to do to get him to where he needs to be, that's what we're here for. When I first met you, it was fun <laughs> to have a bacon and A for a year change it since you got hooked on egg. It's not funny, you guys. Sorry. It's not funny. Sorry. Sorry. <sighs> now, every time I see you, I wonder whether or not you've raided my fridge. <laughs> You've stole from me, Billy. Trish, I've never stole from you. <laughs> my daddy yep. That's right. Okay, I'm sorry. Keep going. <laughs> Keep going. <laughs> the all-time low was when I found you in bed with a heavy chick that you had <laughs> Hormel across her chest between her nipples and big I did that one time. I did that one time. It was a Saturday. <laughs> she wants her Billy back. And we want our Billy back, too. Will you, will you accept our help? Oh, gift. It's not even an issue. I mean, come on, Trisha's reading is worse than my. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You know this what? This isn't about no, Trisha. No, right I'm gonna go. I'll go. Is that what you want to hear? I'll go. <laughs> and your reading is really getting better. <laughs> <laughs>